matchup against the Arizona Diamond Storms, uh, coached by Coach Carson. Uh, we've played Carson twice in SSL, one and one. Um, last season he beat us. A little bit of a wacky game. Uh, I mean, he he beat me clean, um, but like on my part, I, I was just like I was all over the place when I was playing that game. I was uh, look at that cocks all wrong and shit. But uh, regardless, new season. It is week one. Um, Carson has a pretty scary team, so let's get into his team. He has Porygon Z, Malamar, uh, Tangrowth, um, Aloan Muck, Latios, and Skarmory. While on my side of the field, we got Cash Money, the Tornadius, Therian, um, with Knockoff, Heat Wave, U Turn, and Hurricane. Uh, U Turn for Momentum, Hurricane for that Tangrowth, Heat Wave for Galvantula, and Skarmory. More so for Skarmory, because the Hurricane can also hit Galvantula. Um, uh, knockoff for Laddie and just good general stab, uh, or not not stab, good general utility move and U-turn for momentum and to get that nice regenerator health back. Next we have Trish Latias um, rocking a Haban Berry, uh, Haban Berry specifically for the Latios, and uh, this Haban Berry Latias is max speed, max special attack, timid to speed tie with a a Latios. And it has Thunder for Skarmory, Surf, he does have a Mega Camera Op, uh, uh, Draco, and Psyshock. Psyshock there for good general stab, and uh, to hit things like Primera pretty hard, he does have a Primera. Uh, Draco, stab, hard hitting move, Thunder for Skarm, Surf for Mega Camera Op. So far attacking uh, Habanberry, Latias, so kind of, kind of fun. Next we have Isad, the Gastrodon Isad, um, with Toxic Earth Power Scald and Recover. And this has Max HP, Max Special Defense Call, Calm, or Careful Calm, so which, whichever one's the uh, minus attack. I, I forgot I'm blanking here. Um, this is pretty much supposed to be my Primer Era uh, switch in. I think even Specs, a uh, Specs Moonblast. Um, does like 48 ish to 52. Uh, so even if he does get a max roll, left or recoveries will keep me out of 2 hit KO range. Um, that being said, he didn't bring Primera. I was kind of surprised he didn't bring Primera. Um, but if he did bring Primera, could obviously have HP Grass, so I'd, I would have had to be careful about that. But regardless, uh, he didn't bring it, but that, that's that's why I built this Gastron. So, um, just Gastrodon's pretty good too. He, Carson has a lot of special attackers on his team. Uh, he has Porygon Z here, as you can see. Um, Latia, Latios, Mega Camera Up, and a couple other Galvantula. You know, I mean, Galvantula can learn Energy Ball as well. Um, but Camera Up as well. You know, I just need to switch into that. I, I'm kind of surprised he didn't bring Camera Up. Actually, I'm not that surprised he didn't bring Camera Up. My team's pretty fast. Um, but I am kind of surprised that not to see a couple things. Next, we have Top Top, our Togekiss. This is supposed to be our main switch into Laddie Os. Um, to keep him honest on the Dracos, it has Air Slash, Dazzling Gleam, Roos, Defog, Air Slash for Tangrowth, um, and just good general stab. Dazzling Gleam for Laddie Os, Roos for recovery, Defog to remove these hazards. And um, about a mixed, a little bit of a mixed set. So I can take a side shock from, take it somewhat decently, <laughs> side shock from Laddie Os. Next, we have Victor Von Doom, the Mega Hound Doom, rocking uh, Fire Blast, HP Water, Dark Pulse, and Sludge Bomb. Sludge Bomb was a very last minute decision on my part. I, uh, I actually regret it looking at this team. I wish I had, I wish I kept Nasty Plot. And I'll get into it later, but I wish I kept Nasty Plot just to boost and literally just win the game. Um, but. Yeah, I didn't. <laughs> I, I wasn't real enough, and I decided to just throw a sludge bomb last second just so I can have an, another answer for Primera. I was really worried about just getting blown back by Primera. Um, and he didn't even bring it. So I was like, fuck, man. Could have kept, kept Nice Blood. Oh, well. Uh, and then finally, not least, we have our Golden Tea, the Pilot Swine, with uh, Stealth Rocks, Ice Shard, Icicle Crash, and Earthquake. Pretty um, general uh, Pilot Swine. Um, I am almost rocking Max Attack, not quite. Uh, no, I am rocking max attack and then rocking a little bit of mixed defense and then 68 speed to out speed mega camera up, timid mega camera up. I don't see why he would do that if he brought it, but I was just like, just to be safe, just to be safe. Um, so the general strategy of this, this team, this team looking kind of free to, uh, tornadoes to a degree. Um, 
Ladia, and and uh, and uh, Victor Von Doom, the Mega Hound Doom. So, I mean, honestly, anytime those things come in, it should get killed or at least like force a switch and then set up a kill. So I am just gonna lead it off to Tornadus. He doesn't. His this team's looking pretty slow. Um, and we lead off with court cash money, and he leads off with Skarmory, and I'm like, okay, I could heat wave here, or I can knock off. So I decided to knock off, uh, just in case he was predicting this, um, the heat wave or something along those lines. So he leads with, or uh, he um, switches into um, a low and muck. So I knock off the assault vest, and that's good to know that he was an assault vest, and I can get a kind of good idea of what he wants to do. Right here, um, I. I, I have a feeling that he's going to pursue predicting my um, U-turn, and to a degree, that's relatively fine, because he will do like around like 40-ish or 50-ish um, to me on the pursuit, but the regenerator will kick in, and it will uh, get a, like a big chunk of that health back, so pursuit's really not doing that much. So, um, honestly, like if I had to get any mod pursuit drive, it would be 20 years. But So I just go for the U-turn, uh, do a respectable 16%, and he goes for the pursuit. And I get poisoned, and I'm like, ah, oh, dog, for real. And then we go into Gastrodon. Uh, right here, I know he's not going to stay in, so he's probably going to go into Tangrowth. Uh, as you can see, when it's Skarmory. I thought he was going to go into Tangrowth. It works out either way, because I'm going into, I, I'm doubling into Dr. Doom. Or Victor Von. Yeah, Dr. Doom. So, uh, right here, this is where I really wish I had Nasty Plot, because if I had Nasty Plot, then, whew, baby. Talk about game blown back. But, um, yeah, so we don't. So I just go for the Fire Blast right here. And um, we go for the Fire Blast, and it does 47%. And I'm like, all right, I can just go for another Fire Blast right here. And we take out the Lone Muck. So now our Latias is free not to get Pursuit Trapped, which is pretty big. And uh, that means I can like kill things and not get Revenge, which is also pretty clutch. Um, so then he goes into this, and I'm like, okay, whatever he wants to do, I cannot let this thing get like a, an agility up and or like a nasty plot. Like I don't want this thing double dancing on me. Um, he decides to go for Trick Room, which is kind of interesting. And then I decided to go for another Dark Pulse, and I'm like, okay. I get a crit, which is pretty fortunate on my part, but um, even with crit, uh, what is uh, Yeah, no, I mean, crit, crit was pretty big. Um, but then we decide to go into uh, Tup Tup, predicting the superpower, and he does go for the superpower. He does get the plus one, plus one, um, which is kind of uh, uh, annoying and a little scary, especially in the Trick Room. Uh, but... I think we could take one rock slide from this, so I decided to stay in, and he gets the flinch, and I'm like, ah, dog, for real, and kind of unfortunate, I kind of just let Tup Tup die, and Tup Tup only lasts two turns, <laughs> uh, but it, it's alright, because Trick Room's over, and we just decide, go, decide to go back into uh, Mega Hound Doom, he doesn't really have a lot of good answers to this, um, so he decides to go into Latias, or Latios right here, and he decides to Draco, Draco is not taking me out, and um, this Draco meter reveals that he is Choice Scarfed, so that is good to know as well. He decides to go for Draco, and he gets the crit. Crit mattered, he would not have taken me out, unless he was like Modest Scarf, I suppose, but I don't think he was Modest Scarf. Um, but, uh, yeah, but he gets the crit, and that like, definitely secures the KO. And I'm like, dog, for real, man? <sighs> that sucks. I, I should have tried to scout, scout but it is what it is. He's at minus two right here. This is a pretty free U-turn. Uh, so I just go in and U-turn and get the matchup I one, and I go into Batty Ass. Judging by that damage, I don't think he's a Selfist. Or, no, he's not a Selfist because he's Rocky Helmet. Um, I decided to Draco right here because I'm pretty sure Draco has a good chance to take him out here. So, um, or at least do pretty heavy damage to him, or at least make him think that he can take him out. Uh, so I go for the Draco right here, and he goes for the Protect, and I'm like, okay. He's going for the protect. Um, that means he's not going to switch in. He's he might think I'm locked, uh, trying to like think that I would be choice scarf as well to you know match his Latios. But I'm not. I'm Habomberry, and I just had to predict him on the switch and just thunder right here. We do get the para, um, and he we get the para para, and he gets paired, which sucks for him. But he's getting taken out this next turn, and it's not like the Skarmory was going to do much to me anyway, like for real. Um, and we just surf it up. And take this thing out easy. And then he goes into here, and this is where my Haban Berry kicks in. And it does 63%, and we take this thing out with the Draco. So Trish picking up two kills real quick. Um, and then he goes into Porygon 2. I don't want this thing doing anything like Nazi Blotten, uh, like Trick Rooming, 
something like that. anything. I don't want that thing doing anything like that. So all I want to do right here is Draco, and then if he kills me, he kills me. That's cool. Um, if he sets up like a trick room, whatever, we could, uh, you know, and he kills me the next turn. That's fine. I just want this thing to be in ice shard range. Um, so we get it popping, and we go for another uh, Draco right here. Uh, it does not take him out, which whatever. Um, he goes to the trick room and he kill takes me out with ice beam. That's fine. He is in an ice shard range uh, Right here. I, I kind of noticed I was like slower than Porygon Z no matter what so I am faster in it in a trick room So I'm like all right if he wants to be cheeky and go into the like Tangrowth or whatever I like be my guest like I'll just icicle crash right here and bearing a miss this thing should die and it is dead Golden T picks up the kill right here and then he goes for the Giga Drain and we decide to ice school crash and we miss. And I'm like, ah, shit, man. I'm just trying to get some damage off him. And so I just go for the ice shard. It doesn't even do that much. Um, but I just want to get a little chip off. And, like, the way I was feeling in this game, I was just like, I just want some sort of damage. He decides to go for the knock, which is cool. Uh, it doesn't really matter. I think he was predicting me to switch into Tornadoes or something along those lines. Um, which, you know, whatever. Yeah, his, um... Um, but now Trick Room is over, I am faster than this Tangrowth, and we could just go for a Crash right here, and we go for the Crash, get like 39% off, he goes for the Giga Drain, and he gets about 17% of that back, so we just go into Cash Money, and we go and Hurricane, um, and we win 2-0, so, I mean, good game to Carson, good game, good game, man, good game, um, but I really feel like I could have won that game uh, at a higher differential than 2-0, I mean, a win's a win, but uh, I would hate to, uh, you know, have regrets later in the season, like not make playoffs or have some sort of seeding because I didn't get the higher differential. Played played all right. I think I had good prep. I just wanted a higher differential in the 2-0, but I can't complain about a win. Week one is always a tough week, especially for me. Um, but, yeah, that's, that's it. <laughs> that's a match. Uh, let me know what you guys thought of the match, uh, what I could have done differently. Um, obviously, scouting for Scarf over uh, scouting for Scarf Laddie probably should have been the play. Um, should have probably just gone to Pilot Swine right there. But, you know, was feeling the, was hoping for a Mega Doom Sweep, so I <laughs> hope you guys can understand a little bit. But yeah, let me know in the comments what you guys think of the team so far and what you guys think of week one. So, until next week, I'll see you guys later. Moody Claws out. Peace!